That's I told you it was a nice deer, Brad. Oh, you made a beautiful oh shot. Goodness, here's the blood. Hold on. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, what did I kill? What's up everybody? As you can tell by the title of this video, I had a really good weekend. So all the work that we've been doing, all the videos I've been making, all the Texas Race hunting products that I have been repping and putting out in my fields finally paid off. We have so many bucks that are extremely dominant on our properties and finally we took one down. I'm gonna leave a lot of this video raw. I want you guys to see the raw emotion and the happiness, the joy, the awkwardness, the things you do and say after you kill a big buck. So it is what it is. Just it's all about that moment and enjoying it with your family, your friends, your hunt partners, or even if you're just by yourself. So enjoy this video, guys. I'm, I'm enjoying making these videos for you guys and I get so much feedback from you guys. It's really encouraging. So make sure that your brightness is all the way up because the video is a little dark. I shot him literally nine minutes after shooting time. So enjoy, guys. What's up, Shield Outdoors? We came out, we only have a half day to hunt. We have a super long weekend with all kinds of events and we only brought one crossbow. Joey didn't even bring a bow today. He was like, it's gonna be raining and then we're gonna leave early to go shoot. We wanted to zero all of our guns for gun season, just in case, right? In case we don't get our buck by then. And uh, Joey on the way down here was like, dude, I got a good feeling. Uh, 10 minutes before shooting time, two does came through. You couldn't even see anything. The cameras are completely black. And I was kind of like half nodding off and I kind of sat up and I look, and here's Mr. Crab standing 25, 30 yards in front of me. I'm in that far window, and I had the crossbow on my right shoulder, and Joey's like, I can't see him, I can't see him. So I transitioned to my left, and uh, he got out here about 40 yards, and uh, I, maybe you can hear the audio. I'm like literally telling Joey, I'm like, can you see him? Can you see him? And it, I just couldn't wait any longer, so we stuck him. The arrow was covered in blood, and Let's swivel the camera and show what's right in front of our blind. We have right here, boys and girls, is a Texas Rays hunting product scent wig can. And if you come over here, the, the, the ground underneath this can is dry. That's how you know I didn't just stick this here because it's been here since it started raining. You guys, you guys think I'm playing? You guys think I just talk about this stuff for fun? I use this stuff, and it got Mr. Krabs to date. Arrow is covered in blood. I haven't looked at the broadhead till just now, and it broke the tips of the hypodermic off. It must have been the uh, the ribs. All right, guys, it's raining. That's why we're not going to give this much time. We, Joey thinks he saw him go down. The way these hills are, you can't hardly see over these bevels of these hills. So there's not a lot of blood on the ground, but I know I thwacked him and he stumbled once, got his footing, took off, and then Joey said, I think he's stumbling again. We couldn't see because of the leaves. So now up like half an inch. Move your you're you're right on him. <laughs> That's my deer. <laughs> Zoom all the That's him. He's right there on top of the hill, dude. Hold on. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, what did I kill? This ain't Mr. Krabs? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. What? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Oh. What is on his leg? What is this? What? It's an extra hoof? <laughs> this, 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 dude has, this dude has an extra leg. <laughs> he got it. It is. It's an extra hoof. I thought it, dude. I thought this was Mr. Krabs the whole time. That is not Mr. Krabs. We were sadly mistaken. Oh. Dude, I was worried about my shit. Oh my, oh, what, what am I, what, 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 uh, uh, yes, look at this, you, your, your, your fly's undone, bro, oh. look at
at this. Texas raised hunting products. Do you think I'm joking? Look at this buck. I don't know where you're from, but in Indiana, this is a shooter all day. Wow, and the rage hypodermic. Ugh. Oh. <laughs> Pumping out. This is, this is awesome. Well guys, um, I, I really hope I can lighten the video and, and you guys can at least see him uh, take the arrow. Uh, shooting time was, what time was shooting time? 7.31. And then does came through at 7.20. And what time did I shoot him? 7.40. So nine minutes after daylight. On a cloudy, rainy day. Yeah, it is. I mean, it is dark out here still. It's Shooting time was like almost an hour ago and it's supposed to rain all day today. We only planned on hunting till about nine or 10 and then going to the gun range. And uh, this is, it's just, it's unreal. Hey, everybody, thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for being subscribed to Shield Outdoors. Thank you to Texas Raised Hunting Products for getting these bucks as dominant as possible. And uh, we know there's bigger deer out here and uh, hopefully Joey can get one. Texas Raised pr Hunting Products have uh, have really put our properties on the market when it comes to big dominant bucks. Thanks so much for watching. If you aren't subscribed, subscribe and uh, stick around and we're gonna get some more videos out there. And uh, tomorrow we might goose hunt. Thanks guys. I think he might have gone down. I lost him. He disappeared. Are you recording for the shot? Yeah, I'm recording still. You cannot see anything, though, B.